Okay, hello dear friends. We we'll, let's do a piece of painting together. So first, we will go to sketchbook. You open up a sketchbook, and uh, <clears throat> I want to see it. Zoom in a little bit. So we work on the first layer. The first layer. You can see that painting have several layers of color. So the first layer. I will use uh, um, a air spray and very light, very large, and the color we will choose the premier level of color. Okay, so spray some color here on the first level. Oh, this transparency is too much, so. This is the first layer. We need to be a little bit lighter. This is the first layer. Okay, you do not like it like that. So first layer. And now we will add up the second layer of mountain, another layer. Another layer, then the mountain, we will choose a different color, this color, and uh, we will use paint brush to paint it. And um, we will have a certain texture of it. Uh, so you can choose the texture tool. And I would like to have this texture, very light, pale texture. And the width, width of it can be a little bit larger. Opacity, light. Okay, let's do it. So this is the first layer of mountain. If you do not like it, erase it. Now we will do it again. First layer of mountain. Oh, oh, we are doing it on the same layer of, uh, it's okay. Now we will add a new layer. Okay, it will be covered. Don't worry. And this layer, we will do another layer of mountain. First, we will refine it a little bit to make it uh, thinner radius and stronger opacity. Radius smaller and opacity stronger. Okay. The edge of the mountain. Okay, we will do roughly like this. The edge of the mountain. Okay, the mountain is good. Now we do the second layer, okay, add up a new layer, a new layer, the second layer of mountain. So we will first um, save this layer, not save this layer, block this layer so that we will not mess it around. And another layer of mountain, so we will choose which color choose the third level of color good so make it larger much larger so that we can do it much faster How about we fill in color? Use the fill in bucket. Where is my paper? A paint bucket. OK. 
cannot find the bucket. The bucket, oh yes, this is a tool. Few, same color. Few. Okay. And there are these lines, we do not like it. So you can fix it by using this brush tool. Okay. Not few, not few. Yes, deselect the few and uh, so this is the third layer. Add a new layer. We do another mountain, another layer of mountain, another layer of mountain. We need to choose color, this level of color. Okay, so. And we will fill in color. Okay, now deselect the fill and erase this part. Okay, now we will do the new layer of add another layer here. So another layer here and the color we will choose even darker this color how about that i think i can use just my finger to do it instead of anything else okay now we will do even another layer this is new layer the next layer, add a new layer. Okay, we will choose another color. Do we still have color? Yes, dark, dark blue. And uh, let me add another layer. Okay, I think we are at the maximum of our layering, so there's no way to add new layer. We will not add new layer, but we will use the same layer to... Okay, so this way the mountain is roughly coming out and you want to roughen uh, you want to add some more texture of it so you can put different color we add some texture of it and for example this one oh, oh stop go back so we go back to the first layer the first layer this layer we need to work on and we are not we can enclose the rest of the layers if we like so we are working on the background, almost background layer. This layer, we do not need to work that much. This layer is good. This layer, we will do some texturing. So this layer, okay. Um, hmm, we will use which color? Just a tiny bit. Choose the color. We are using this color, right? And now we will use the color a little bit darker than this. And with certain texture, this is the brush. And the texture, we will use the texture like this. How about this? No, how about this? This is the texture we want to try. Okay? You cannot see very, very clear but uh, there are some teeny tiny bit of texturing which make it just make it a little bit darker okay even darker see you can see you may not be even able to see this texture and now we work on this layer this layer this layer we want to make the color a little bit darker than this so let's go here 
Okay, that's that's interesting enough. You just want to create some different texture. Okay, this layer. Now we work on this layer. Now we work on this layer. The last layer. Show, show. This last layer we will use. No, well, this we layer we have not yet worked on. So this layer we will choose what color we will choose. We will choose some gray color. How about that? See? Come out some texturing. And the last layer we will this layer we will work on this layer and some very very dark for here. Okay, this one we will use such You see any work on this layer? Yeah, start to show a little bit of this so we have a different layer of color. So that's about it actually. There is no end how much you can you can work on on it, right? So you can always keep on working. But this is roughly the method of doing it. And you can add trees, add different things. So hope this one is, uh, is good for you. Thank you very much.